I can't express how important it is when building a brand to be authentic. Like that should be your very first, first step. You should not strive to fake it till you make it. Like that's just not how you're gonna be successful. Hey, what's up guys, Grant Weiss here. Question I get asked so frequently is what is my first step to really building a brand that people wanna be a part of? Now, we talk a lot about generating leads and that is crucial, that's a crucial first step in a lot of cases, but brand building is relationship building. It's our opportunity to build a relationship with a prospect who doesn't really know us yet and is now kind of going through that discovery phase of figuring out who it is that we are, what it is that we do, and how it is we can help them. I can't express how important it is when building a brand to be authentic. Like that should be your very first, first step. You should not strive to fake it till you make it. Like that's just not how you're gonna be successful. Like look, today I woke up and I put on a Cardinals jersey, right? I'm repping uh, my man, Mr. Ozzy Smith. Wanted to make sure, right, right? But I'm, I'm being authentic. I'm being who I want to be, I'm being genuine. And it, and it allows me to be genuine when I'm not trying to rely on perception to do my, my dirty work, right? And in a relationship building process, it's key, it's paramount to your success. So when you're thinking about, okay, how can I be authentic? What if it scares this client off and scares this client off? That's the goal, right? For as much as we're marketing, we're unmarketing. When we're building a brand and we're being who we want to be, we're going to get a tribe of raving fans and we're going to get a tribe of people that don't like us, that don't want to see us succeed and sometimes might even try to work against it. You need that. You need that loyal, faithful followers uh, or, or band of followers to really take you to the next level. So in being authentic, it comes back to one of the first laws of marketing and that's marketing's messaging. And you gotta know who you're syndicating that message to. Cause it's easier for me to talk directly to you than me to talk to you and the fitness expert and the credit repair person and the banker and the restaurant manager. If you find that ideal client, that person that you want to do business with, it becomes so easy to know how to talk to them. You know where they hang out, you know where they shop, you know where they buy clothes, you know what their favorite sports teams are. You probably know corporately what types of jobs they have, what types of income levels. You know how to interact with that person because you've now defined them. And therefore your actions are two things. They're very intentional because you're now intentionally reaching out to these people you know you want to do business with and they're very authentic because in most cases our niche, the client we want to do business with, is like us. When you're building a brand and you're doing it authentically, you get to define who your client is and when you do that, you really get to go out and build a relationship, an authentic relationship, not a fake relationship that's relying on the benzo that you can't afford and the house that you never wanted, right? You gotta remember, people love people. This is a relationship game and your brand is an opportunity for you to build that relationship kind of on autopilot or automatic. <clears throat> You've gotta be authentic in doing so. My first step in building a brand for you, just A, get really clear on who it is that you wanna do business with, it makes it easier for you to be authentic when it comes to building a brand. Hopefully you guys got some value out of this today. If you ever want any help understanding like, okay, I'm starting to get this. How do I develop a client niche? How do I build a brand? Feel free to, to reach out to me, connect with me, follow the links I got attached to this video and we'll jump on. We'll give you some ideas for how you can build a brand, how you can build out that client profile. Thanks guys, peace.